What I don't understand is, if you have problems with the United States, why did you make the Ukraine pay for it? By taking, the, taking Crimea and <clears throat> being well on the way to annexing or splitting Ukraine. What did the pu poor, poor Ukrainians do that you punished them for the malfeasance of the United States? Um, well, I think you have a distorted view. Uh, we are not going uh, to take revenge on someone, particularly at other people's expense. We're seeking normal relations with the United States. It was not us who destroyed um, uh, um, the mechanisms uh, of uh, those uh, relations that were established in recent years. And Russia is party to that conflict. I think this is something that we have to um, acknowledge. Uh, your description of uh, the situation in Ukraine is not correct. It was not a coup d'etat, but it was an agreement with President Yanukovych that had been uh, approved of by the majority of parliament. Two elections, free elections took place where 80 percent uh, spoke out in favor uh, for the European Union. The nationalists and separatists only received two or three percent of the votes. And that is the situation, the true situation in domestic politics in Ukraine. Uh, there are um, international rules uh, that uh, are sometimes interpreted differently by different people. What happened in Crimea uh, was um, the exercise of the right of self-determination. It's part of the UN Charter. The UN Charter enshrines uh, several principles, in particular, the right of nations uh, to self-determination. It is a key principle of the UN Charter. Um, uh, you've got to read uh, the UN Charter. Territorial um, uh, integrity and sovereignty must be respected. And the UN uh, General <laughs> Assembly adopted a declaration. <laughs> Ну, может, смешно, я не well, знаю. Мне тоже было смешно, я сдерживался. Who uh, attacked whom? Donetsk and Luhansk uh, did not attack Kiev. No, it was Kiev uh, that sent troops to Donetsk and Luhansk. Uh, Donetsk and Luhansk held a referendum on their independence and accession to Russia. This is not something that happened uh, in Kosovo. Uh, Germany uh, got reunited without a referendum. And we were an active uh, supporter of that process after the Second World War. Germany uh, will remember the Soviet Union was against the split in Germany. Thank you. And um, we have to understand our position and the principles we are guided by. And of course you can laugh about this. But then somebody is going to have fun, and this is uh, life. The issues we are discussing here, I think, are no laughing matter from any side.